to all my Fox Hollow fam and welcome to Baking with Fox Hollow Kitchen. I'm Dave and in this episode we're going to turn everything on its head. We're going to show you how to make pineapple upside down cake. Now when I was a kid we used to request pineapple upside down cake instead of birthday cake and my mom would gladly make it for us. She used to use crushed pineapple instead of pineapple rings but no matter how you bake it it's still the best. So if you're ready then let's have some fun. Okay, the first thing we're gonna do is coat the bottom of a 13 by nine inch pan with a quarter cup of melted butter. Get this all out of here. Use as much as we can. Just smear that around until it's all over. And then we're gonna take a cup of brown sugar and sprinkle over the butter. It doesn't have to be perfect because uh, we're going to smooth it out later. Once we've coated the bottom of our pan with brown sugar, we're going to lay down pineapple rings as close together as possible and just press them in gently. And then finally, we're going to garnish these with maraschino cherries. Now you don't have to use the cherries if you don't like them. Some people don't like cherries at all, but I don't mind them. So we're going to put a cherry in each pineapple. And there we go. We're going to set this aside while we make our batter. Now for our batter, we're going to need three eggs. a half cup of vegetable oil, and one cup of pineapple juice, which I saved from our pineapples earlier. If you don't have a full cup, um, use lemon lime soda or just water to make it one cup. It'll be fine. And then finally, uh, your favorite yellow cake mix. Just one portion of that. And then we're going to mix this together, slowly at first. There, once our batter is completely mixed, it's time to move on to the next step. Next, we're going to pour our batter over top of our pineapples. Make sure we get every bit of it out of here. And then smooth this out just a little bit so that it goes to all four corners. And that's it. We're going to throw this in the oven at 350 degrees for 30 to 35 minutes until a toothpick comes out clean. Now that our cake has come out of the oven, we're going to place a cookie sheet over top of this and then turn it upside down onto the cookie sheet. And we're just going to leave it here for about five minutes for all the caramel to saturate. And now we carefully take this off of here. And there it is. Pineapple upside down cake. And now for everybody's favorite part, the taste test. Now that's so fruity and sweet, and the pineapple really hits the spot. I hope you enjoy. Wrapping up today, I want to thank you all for joining us and encourage you to check out our friends and support channels listed in the description below. But before I go, I want to leave you with these words from Audrey Hepburn. The best thing to hold on to in life is each other. Thanks again, and we'll see you all soon. Happy Mother's Day from us at Fox Hollow Kitchen. If you like this video or any of our other videos, be sure to hit the like and subscribe buttons and stay tuned for future shows.